was designed to be the support vehicle for the uh, dismounted troops, for the infantry, basically. And it's not very big, it's like a small car, and you can see that it's designed the way that we can put different payloads in the middle. So we can put the weapon system, for example, or radio system, or we can also use it for casualty evacuation, or we can put the rucksacks and ammunition and mines, for example, in the middle. So different uh, uh, goods, and we can transport it to the, to the troops. We have the battery, basically, that provides energy for the wheels, and then it can run on the battery, but on the other side, we have the uh, diesel engine. So the diesel engine is used to produce the electricity to the battery. And this system works together this way. So basically it's a hybrid vehicle. The payload capacity is about uh, uh, 750 kilo kilograms. And if you put a little bit more, that's okay as well. Here you can also see the radio systems or the antennas. So at the moment uh, we are using very simple a military radio so that the operator, if it wants to uh, balance or operate the vehicle from the distance, uh, then the operator can use the radio system. Also, what is possible, we can put the other type of radio so that you can use it over, over the satellite, for example. It has lidars and other sensors, cameras, as you can see, and these are used for the different operations. And also it has a uh, autonomy features. So it has a waypoint navigation. You can also, uh, for example, the operator can steer the first vehicle and others can be behind as a convoy. And uh, you can use it this way.